In this video, we'll be talking about how to create a title and a lower third graphic. So let's start with creating a title. So first thing, we're gonna go into File, New, and Legacy Title. Press OK, and that'll bring up the title that we wanna make. So then just click anywhere, and you can type whatever you wanna type in. We're gonna type in Jason, that's the name of this guy. From there, we can adjust all these parameters here, and uh, we can choose a font. Personally, one of my favorite fonts is Helvetica New. And then we'll go and we can move around here. I like condensed black. So from there, something that you'll notice is whenever you create a title, it's not pure white. If you go into the color, you can see that it's kind of this off white. So I always make sure that I bring it to pure white. And then from there, we can adjust a lot of different things as well. We can adjust the font size here. Aspect, I don't really use. Leading is what happens if there's two different lines of text. If you add, if you increase that, it'll increase or decrease the distance between the two lines. So we're gonna keep that at zero. And then we're gonna delete this, keep it on the first one. Tracking creates space in between the letters. So you'll notice that a lot of cinematic movie trailers will have letters that are spread out kind of like that. So I like to spread them out maybe just a little bit. So maybe something like four. And then baseline shift, I don't really use. And slant makes it just a little bit tilted, which I don't use as well. Down here, you can see that there are other options of fill and strokes. If I ever use strokes, I do outer strokes, and that makes it so that it creates an outline on each one of the letters. And then you can increase or decrease that stroke right there. So yeah, a lot of parameters that you can adjust here, but we're gonna take off the stroke for this one. And then you can add a shadow which I usually have the size of about 10. I usually have the spread of about 50. And as you can see, that's what it looks like with and without the shadow. So personally, I really like the look of a shadow, especially with white on black. So I like having that there. And that's basically it for those parameters. And now if we wanna center it, we can center it here and then center it here. So that makes it perfectly center. Or we can adjust the X and Y position to put it exactly where we want. So uh, we can just stick it right here. We can create a lower third like that. And then as soon as we exit out, we have this title that we can just drag on top. And our title is right there. And then if you want to, you can animate the title. You can animate the keyframes, have it come in like that. Do whatever you'd want with it. So now we're gonna talk about lower thirds. So we're gonna delete this. We're gonna go into window, work space and then we're gonna go into graphics so this brings us into our essential graphics tab and a cool thing you can do with this is you can look through all of these different graphics and you can click and drag and put them into Premiere so it's gonna load here for a second and then we can go in here and we can adjust the text so we just adjusted our text here and now we can adjust the master scale to make it bigger or smaller and uh, we can move it over a little bit right here to make it look better and then, as you can see, each lower third has its animation that comes in like that. So that's how you create a little graphic for your lower thirds. And that about does it for this video. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.